for Bible Answers with John Matthews. Hello viewers, my name is John Matthews and welcome to Bible Answers, where you call in and give me all your Bible queries and I answer for you. Well, we're going to jump right in and take our first caller. Uh, hi, John. Uh, I like your show. Um, thank you for, for taking my call. Well, you're quite welcome. Who am I talking to today? Uh, uh, my name is uh, Michael. Michael, that's a great name. You know, it's an angel named Michael. Yeah, I've heard. And Michael, isn't it a beautiful day the Lord has provided for us? Uh, yeah, not really. Uh, my basement's uh, flooded. But speaking of floods, uh, I had a question. Uh, my question is about Noah's Ark. Oh, yes, that's one of my very favorite stories. Yeah, I, I figured it was. I was just wondering, uh, how did Noah collect two of every animal's uh, on Earth, in the allotted amount of time he was given in the story. Oh, that's an easy one, Caller. <laughs> yes. Okay, I don't really think that answers the question. So you're saying that he collected animals from other continents, which would require months of travel on boat alone? Well. Not with the power of God on your side. Well, okay. So, he got, like, kangaroos and polar bears? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. And... Okay, so, then how did the penguins... How did they survive? Well, it's right here in the Bible. I don't Next caller. Bible answers. What's your question? Uh, hi. <laughs> um, my question is... <laughs> shut, shut, shut up. My question is, is does Jesus have boobs? <laughs> I, I'm sorry, caller. What was the question again? Uh, uh, I said, uh, does Jesus have boobs? Does Jesus have boobs? Is that your question? Uh, <laughs> yes. Yeah. Uh, well, to be quite honest with you, caller, um, I have to say that uh, Judas, he was a, uh, he was quite a boo. So yes, suppose uh, Jesus had a boob. <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> okay, all right. Awesome. <laughs> I too get very giddy when it comes to Jesus. So. Obviously, Goliath, if he was a giant, and we don't, well, there's dinosaur bones, but no giant bones. Well, Cole, let me start by saying that, uh, as we all know, dinosaur bones were planted under the earth by Satan. And uh, on that note, we should all recognize that uh, science has made a mockery of religion for years. Next caller. Uh, uh, hi. I had a question about Adam and Eve. Uh, they're the first of man, so does that mean that they were cavemen? Okay, caller. Uh, cavemen do not exist. Do you believe in 
cavemen? They've, they've been proven. Oh, well, I suppose you also believe in uh, uh, the tooth fairy, uh, Easter Bunny, Eskimos. Uh, I think that... Collar, we're not talking about fictional characters. We're talking about Jesus. Well, thank you. Well, I'd like to thank all my callers for calling in today, giving me all their questions. Uh, Bible answers all. And if you can't figure out the answers, give me a call. See you next week on Bible Answers. Mm -hmm.